Please stand as America the Beautiful is played. Please be seated. Welcome to the 93rd commencement ceremony of the Sam M. Walton College of Business at the University of Arkansas. I'm Matt Waller, and I'm honored to serve as Dean of the Walton College. We gather here this afternoon as a milestone in the lives of the candidates for degrees, our spring and summer 2020 graduates, who we were unable to formally recognize last May. This year has been one of much uncertainty, but we want to commend them for their achievements and scholarship, celebrate with them the joy of this accomplishment, and acknowledge this important phase in their lives. This is just the beginning. I would like to direct your attention to the printed program you can find details about the adornments worn by our students indicating special recognitions. Gathered with us today are many individuals who have been active participants in the education of these degree candidates. At this time, I would like to introduce some of them to you, beginning with the members of our platform party. Dr. Charles Robinson, Provost and Executive Vice Chancellor for Academic and Student Affairs, Dr. Ann O'Leary Kelly, Senior Associate Dean, Dr. Brent Williams, Associate Dean for Executive Education and Outreach and Interim Department Chair for Marketing, Dr. Alan Elstrand, Associate Dean for Programs and Research, Dr. Gary Peters, Chair of the Department of Accounting, Dr. John Johnson, Chair of the Department of Strategy, Entrepreneurship, and Venture Innovation. Understandably, several of our department chairs, faculty, and board of trustee members could not be with us today, but they send their sincere congratulations. Additionally, I would like to introduce our chancellor for the University of Arkansas, Dr. Joe Steinmetz who will be sharing a few remarks. Chancellor Steinmetz. Thank you, Matt. And uh, first of all, I'll begin with a good afternoon and a congratulations to each and every one of you on today's achievement. I think we can agree that college is hard enough to get through. This year has added some new obstacles to an already challenging path. Nevertheless, you've reached one of the greatest milestones of your life. You've earned a college degree. I hope that you get some time in the days and in the weeks and in the months ahead to soak that in and really appreciate what you've done. Under normal circumstances, you would have probably gone out and celebrated with family and friends. 
but unfortunately these are not normal circumstances. But while there may be an unusual time to graduate right now, there is never, ever, ever a bad time to be a college graduate. Earning a college degree is one of the most profoundly transformative things you can do in your life. So I urge you not only to take pride in this accomplishment, but also to use your degree as a passport to better opportunities and more challenging experiences. I hope the time and the effort it took to earn this degree has instilled in you the confidence to attempt still bigger things in the years ahead. Doors you never imagined walking through will now be open for you. Find them and walk through them to a deeper and a more meaningful life. Use your degree to fulfill the promise of your own vast potential. And finally, I hope your years at the University of Arkansas will be among your most cherished memories. I know one thing, we're grateful to have had you on campus these last few years. You are and you forever will be a graduate of the University of Arkansas. Make the most of it and congratulations. Thank you, Chancellor Steinmetz. Because we are unable to host a commencement speaker this year, I would like to direct your attention to our video screens for some words of inspiration from our past commencement speakers. Commencement first, and think about the word commencement. Commencement is to commence, and it means to begin. It's not about the end of something, it's the beginning of something. And today, you should feel accomplished. You've accomplished great things. This is a special day, you'll never forget this. Don't forget it. This is one of those moments you look back with the sun, the sun shining and people hugging and people happy. You, you wanna stand on this wonderful moment in time and remember it as one of those bright shining days in your life where you launch off into this new beginning. Today, the question is about you. What will your story be? Here's what I know. I know that success and achievement is what this college has prepared you for. So don't think of today as an ending. Rather, think of it as a beginning. And rather than setting the bar low and being surprised when things turn out better than what you'd expected, set the bar high for yourself. Expect excellent excellence and don't accept anything less. These characteristics demonstrate leadership for the rest of the world. Not perfection, but genuine leadership. The best is yet to come. Believe it. You are going to be a part of it. You are the future. Here you have learned about pride. You've learned about passion. And now you have the opportunity to take it into the world. Sam Walton once said, quote, I am absolutely convinced that the only way we can improve one another's quality of life is through what we call free enterprise, practiced correctly and morally. Excellence in your work creates opportunities for you. And you see, in business, we redefine hustle into the word excellence. And you will hear us speak about do your work with excellence. And that means we want you to give everything that you have to doing your very best work. If you want to stand out from the pack, you must be committed to learning and improving. Finally, you have to relax, enjoy what you do. And there's something equally important you've gained during your time here. It's the foundation of enduring values. Values like taking responsibility for your community, keeping an open mind and an open heart, standing for something larger than yourself. As you embark on your own life's voyage, let those values be your guide. And no matter how far you travel, they will serve you well and you will always feel at home. 
and it's your generation that will be running this country in the next 30 or 40 years. Uh, you've got some challenges ahead of you, but if you can go forth from here with ideas of integrity and honesty and compassion, using your brains a little bit, making good decisions, uh, we'll be okay. And now I know a lot of you would love to just spend your entire life here in Fayetteville, but I can tell you 22 years later, you can continue to come back and Dixon Street will be everything you remembered it was when you were here. Today is also a celebration of the accomplishments of our graduates, the class of 2020. Therefore, it is only fitting that they have a voice in the ceremony. Please direct your attention to the video screens again for a message from our student speaker, Donita Hadley. Hi, I'm Danita Hadley, and I'm honored to speak on behalf of the Walton College graduating class of 2020. I'd like to thank everyone at the university who worked so hard to make this event possible. I know we all have goals and visions of what our life will be like and what we'll be doing after graduation. But if this year has shown us anything, it's that things don't always go according to plan. My goal was always to graduate as a Razorback, and I've taken many detours to get here today. In fact, three of them, my sons, are here watching me graduate. I started at the university when I was 17 years old in 1986. But things happened and I made choices, some good and some not so good, and I didn't graduate the first time around but I came back to the university in the fall of 2018, and I am proud to say that I am graduating at the age of 52. This year has presented many challenges, and we all have risen to meet each one to make it here today. Just realize there'll be many more challenges, roadblocks, and detours in life, but you can overcome each one. It is never too late to achieve your goals. Go Hogs! Thank you, Danita. Danita's family is attending the 630 ceremony tonight, and I'm certain they're very proud. Congratulations, Danita. It is now the time for that which brings us together. At this time, we'll begin the conferring of degrees. One thing I want to mention to all the students, please listen to this carefully. Pick up anything you want to take with you because you won't be coming back to your seat. So make sure you take everything with you. The faculty of the Walton College has approved these candidates for graduation with the degree of Bachelor of Science in Business Administration and Bachelor of Science in International Business, subject to the fulfillment of all catalog college and university academic requirements. We will also recognize our master's and doctoral students. Students, please remain seated until the line coordinators escort you to the stage. And again, bring everything with you because you won't go back to your seat. As your name is called, please proceed up the ramp to the stage and pick up the diploma cover. Pose briefly for the camera and exit the stage towards the west and to the back of the arena. Please pause for another photo and your Walton gift before exiting the arena through the tunnel. Parents and guests may meet your graduates outside near the east side of the arena. Jenny Garber.
Catherine Jewel Pace, summa cum laude. Kennedy Sihapanya. Lydia Grace Adair, summa cum laude. Haley Celeste Aguirre. Michael Ryan Chapman. Matthew Frederick Crenshaw, summa cum laude. Andy Stephen Kubias. Caroline Dallas, cum laude. Mason Gilsinger. Madeline Ray Harvey. Clarence Ernest McGee. Lacey Rose Moore, summa cum laude. Hannah Nicole Nixon. Connor Martin Osborne. Ivan Cecilio. Stephanie Marie Porch. William Hayden Pounds. Hunter J. Roberts, cum laude. James Blake Ryan. Allison Camille Schutte. Sabrina M. Stevenson. Brandon Tyler Still. Kate Truitt, cum laude. Vinicius Tome Viana. Cum laude. Mireya Violantes. Maxwell Wayforth, magna cum laude. Catherine Humans. Grace Elizabeth Cohen. Caitlin Elizabeth Hedgecock, cum laude. Mason English, summa cum laude. Alexis Alberan. Brandon Anthus.
Elizabeth Blair Blackburn. Gunnar J. Carlson. Colton W. Chapin. Kyle Milton Coates. Brock Thomas Davis. Michael Douglas Dow. Sydney Nicole Ferguson. Tanner Andrew Fernie. Carly Brooke Greenhaw, cum laude. Victoria Dieno. Eric Hamilton Johnson. Corey Joseph Johnston. Jessica Helen Jerica. Adele Louise Legrays, with distinction. Ryan Thomas Libby. Timothy John Petrovich Limcher. August Mays. Logan McGregor, cum laude. Jared Carl Miller. Luke Anthony Mitchell, with distinction. Kelly Ann O'Toole. Mason Tanner Overstreet. Kedrin Olin Rayburn. Robert Mitchell Ross, Jr. Paulo E. Scala. Christopher Schrar. Corey Shorter. Suzanne Lee Whittenton. Kaylin Powell Williams. Austin Young. Isaac Abar Benavidez. Connor Stephen Cook. Corbin Davis.
Lindsay Young Davis. Stephanie Figueroa. Abby Elizabeth Klingensmith. Robert Joshua Terry. Robert Calvin Van Franken. Casey Walker. Noah Kagan Wallace. Alec James Barkley. Madison A. Bloomfield. Lauren Brooke Cardenas. Hannah Lynn Carpino. Madison E. Castleberry. Lizbeth Puga. Alice Chan, cum laude. Brooke Elizabeth Dollar. Jacob William Friddle. Gunnar Ray Gilbert, summa cum laude. John Nolan Hedgecock. Julia Ann Jeffrey. Jarrett Michael Jones. Lindsay Meredith Jurchak. Anna Maria Justice, magna cum laude. Catherine Elizabeth Couch. Brittany Lee Laney. William Garrett LaRue. Jared Longoria. Teresa Maldonado Pareto. Stephanie Minetti Dollar. Darby Novich. Leslie Anai Ortiz. Stephanie Lynn Perez. Jillian Nicole Pettit. Brianna K.R. Green. Carlisa N. Adams.
Jordan Anderson. Avery Brett Barker. Brett David Bauer. Monica Elise Braun, magna cum laude. Catherine Michelle Burke. Landry Catherine Chopin. Claire Cook Gatos, magna cum laude. Ricardo Diaz Huerta. Morgan Marie Ellis. Brielle Suzanne Ferris. Brooke Emily Fine. Jenna Nicole Hawker. Nicholas Hartley. Chase Hayden. Kirsten Bonnie Laura Hobbs. Madison Lee Hummelsign. Grace Camille Ingram. Hannah Lee Keelan. Amanda Kiernan. Catherine Elizabeth Langston, cum laude. Kaylee Eileen Makeda. Eden Pauline McClanahan. Madison Elizabeth McKim. Samantha Grace Morio. Kristen Rose Mount. Shelby Parker. Luke Rapert. Luke's degree is being conferred by his mother, Dr. Molly Rapert, Associate Professor of Marketing. Colin W. Richardson. Meredith Riddle. Nico Scala.
Brandon Stokes. Jocelyn Trevino Perez. Caleb Velez, cum laude. Lindsay Ann Wagaman. Benjamin Ames Warren. Haley Lee Wilson. Edgar Garcia Arroyo. Elizabeth Victoria Caldwell. Lin Khan Gao. Jacob Brian Dries. Desiree Janelle Dantzler Dunlap. Mahogany Simone Galloway. Mackenzie Joseph Gregory. Raymond Lee Guasco II. Megan Hammonds. Natasha Leanne Hensley. Jamie Randia Hunt. Caitlin Leanne Laney. Mackenzie Lynn Meehan. Amanda Grace Nunes. Erin Pacheco. Samuel Coleman Rydling. Jesus Avila Rojas. Kate Ross. Sam Silva Nash, summa cum laude. Sean Williams. Mohammed Zian. Christopher Ross Pardon. We will now present the diplomas for candidates of the Masters of Accountancy. They are escorted by Dr. Jonathan Shipman, Associate Professor of Accounting and Co-Director for the Masters of Professional Accounting. Himani Chauhan. We will now present the diplomas of candidates for the degree of Masters of Information Systems. They are escorted by Dr. Mary Lassity, Professor of Information Systems and director of the Blockchain Center of Excellence. Aaron De La Vega. Walter Steve Diaz.
Amanda Leanne War. Axel Shema. Stephanie Nicole Angulo. We will now present the diplomas of candidates for the degree of Masters of Business Administration. They are joined on stage by Dr. Alan Elstron, Associate Dean for Academic Programs and Research. Haidar Aziz. <laughs> Ashley D. Ferguson. Luis Gioielli. <laughs> Marina Grabski. <laughs> Philip M. Keen. Sudhir R. Koyagura. <laughs> Maximo Lau. Kirsten H. Meyer. Amit Kumar Pandey. <laughs> Corey Valdez Brewer. We have one student who is completing the PhD in the Walton College. She is going to be joined on stage by Dr. Brent Williams, Associate Dean for Outreach. Ashley Deutsch Sermon. 